Well, a very good afternoon, good evening, or a big hello to you wherever you might be listening to this coaching cafe. My name is Natalie Ashdown from the Open Door Coaching Group, and I am joined by Paula Jones Hunt, our resident HR specialist. Hello to you, Paula. Hi. Welcome to you all. Uh, you might be listening to this podcast from your favourite streaming service or listening to it, to it live. Today we're talking about how do we make a difference and specifically we're talking about our accredited coach trainers program today, giving you all the information that you might need uh, to become involved in what we're planning with accredited coach training. So before I begin, let me acknowledge the traditional owners on the lands and the custodians of the lands on which we meet today and their continuing connection to the land, waters and communities of Australia and not only that our New Zealand neighbours and our international communities as well. We pay our respects to them to elders past present and emerging and anyone who might be listening currently or on the line from an Aboriginal or Torres Strait Islander or Indigenous uh, descent. So welcome to you all. So today, our agenda, it's really to uh, talk to you more about our accredited coach training program, what it actually means for you as coaches uh, and people who are influencing coaching within your organisation, why we would love for you to get involved. Um, as you know, if you are new to the Coaching Cafe, we are all about creating a community. We come together at this time every Friday and we also stream on the podcast uh, to create that shared learning experience in having thought provoking conversations and normally we do have a free ICFCC use to available but not today because we really are talking about a program um, as opposed to introducing tools etc to you but if you are new to the cafe welcome uh, we look forward to picking up our normal uh, educational and knowledge sharing sessions uh, as we go along next week. Uh, if you'd like to interact with us, we feel free to do that by popping a message into the chat box um, and we can pick up your questions and comments as we go along as well. So feel free to interact by hitting the chat box. So talking about our accredited coach training program, it's a very exciting opportunity. We really wanted to share this with as many people as possible. Just a bit of a quick background for you. Um, Open Door Coaching, since 2007, we've actually been offering our coaching qualifications, as many of you know, as uh, most of the people on the line, actually, I can see a lot of alumni on the line, you've all completed um, our certificate four in workplace and business coaching and or our diploma of organisational coaching. And for many, many years now, we have been an ICF um, accredited coach training program organisation. Back in 2022, the ICF changed all the rules around this to bring in new regulations into uh, coach training, uh, new, what it, changing what it meant to actually be a, a coach training organisation with an international standard. And so we transitioned everything that we were doing already uh, to become an accredited coach training organization. And so that's just a little bit of uh, background for you. But what it means now is that you can become a level one accredited coach trainer with Open Door. Um, and if you'd like to become a level one accredited coach trainer, you can go out and deliver the level one program. So your people, whoever you deliver the program to, can actually achieve a level one ICF accredited level one workplace and business coaching certification. So it's very exciting. Uh, what this means is you can, that the training that you've enjoyed, that you've been part of, um, if you're an alumni, uh, you can actually go out and deliver that training now under the ICF banner uh, and enabling your people to achieve level one ICF accreditation. So maybe people within all your organisation want to go on and achieve their ACC uh, the ICF ACC, well, you can now be the one that delivers that program to enable people to do it. So it's it's an exciting development. Um, it does mean uh, uh, big changes um, for us here at Open Door because we're now not the only ones who will be delivering uh, accredited coach training. We now have this amazing alumni uh, that people can tap into and can be part of, uh, of the delivery as well. So let me pause just for a moment. Uh, hopefully that makes sense to everyone. And I'll pick up any questions that you might have um, as we go along. Paula, did you want to make any comments at this point? 
Uh, no, I, I think it's. I think it is super exciting. Um, I think um, when I was working in house HR, it would have been the perfect opportunity to really um, build a, a culture of coaching. If you can train your coaches, um, if you could train your managers to be workplace coaches and be able to get ICF accreditation as well, um, and so I, I think there's there's lots of opportunities for it. Um, for people to utilise it in, in lots of different ways. Yeah, absolutely. And a great question um, Leanne has actually asked. Thank you for jumping in there. She says, does this just apply to the Open Door Coaching alumni? Well, no, the answer is no. It applies more broadly. And so when we think about who, who this opportunity might be for, it really is for anyone who's trying to build a culture of coaching within your organisation. Um, or maybe you are already an accredited coach or a certified coach and you want to build a new income stream in delivering coach training to the people that you service as clients. Um, so there's a couple of different ways of thinking about this. Perhaps as, you, as Paula mentioned, uh, you have already achieved some coach training and now you want to take level one accredited coach training to the broader people within your organisation. Or perhaps you are an executive coach, you have had coach training um, and you would like to now be able to deliver to your clients. So we are all about building a powerful coalition. Um, we have, for those of you that know our certificate for in workplace and business coaching, we, we talk a lot about uh, coaching through change and, and Cotter's eight step model for change. And really in that model, as you, as you would be aware, you know, to achieve any great vision, to achieve any great uh, set of goals, we need to build a powerful coalition around us. So that's what we're really trying to do, build this wonderful group, a powerful coalition of accredited coach trainers who can now bring uh, bring the training to your organisation. So um, thanks for the question, uh, uh, Leanne, you don't have to be um, an open door coaching alumni, so you don't have to have uh, completed our programs um, in order to to to, um, to become a level one accredited coach you do have to have achieved some level of coach training though so uh, the program is open to people who have have done coach training um, and in order to be able to deliver the program at some point you need to be able to achieve your ACC so if you're already an ACC or a PCC with the ICF you've already achieved your credential, then we would be really, really happy to talk to you about this opportunity. Um, in order to deliver the level one accredited coach training, you do have to hold an ACC or PCC um, or be on the way to achieving that. So we'll talk about that a bit more in, in, in a moment. So it really is for anyone who wants to build coaching within organisations, who want who want to do what we do, make create organisations that we can be proud of, using coaching skills to enable high performance in organisations. What will you be delivering? So for many of you who are alumni, you will be delivering the program that you know and you love, the program that you have been through uh, with the added bonus of the open door support structure. So everything that we do, you have that as a bonus. Um, if you're not an open door alumni, what that means is we have modules of accredited coach training. You'll be learning how to deliver those modules. Um, it includes coaching demonstrations and a coaching assignment. And the idea that we have have is that you can arrange the training, you arrange the, the, the people that need to be on that training course, you arrange the venue, et cetera, et cetera, and we send to you everything you need to, to, to actually implement that coach training. So think about uh, like I do now, I walk, I walk into a, a room and the course materials, the, the trainer materials, uh, the agenda, everything I need to be successful in order to deliver the training um, is ready for me. And my team, the Open Door team, send that um, all around Australia and internationally, they send boxes out the door. So as an accredited, a level one accredited coach trainer, you can be confident that you're walking into the coach training uh, with the full backing of Open Door Coaching to enable you to do what you do best, which is deliver great training.
So we're not finding the clients. You need to find the clients. You need to, um, you know, look after those commercial arrangements and the venue hire, et cetera, et cetera. But we are enabling you under a license agreement to go out and deliver the training. So in order to do this, we are running an accredited coach trainers course. It's going to be held here in Melbourne uh, on the 11th to the 15th of, of September. The investment is at $3,950. Um, so that's the first, uh, the first that'll be our very first course that, that we run. Um, and once you've completed the accredited coach trainers course, you have the ability to sign a service agreement and that service agreement then enables you to go and deliver the training. Uh, in order to sign a service agreement before you can deliver the training, as we said, you do need to hold an ACC or a PCC, so uh, International Coach Federation credential. Um, you might be on your way to achieving that. So you can still do the coach training uh, and then wait until you achieve your ACC in order to go and deliver. So there's, there's um, that requirement is in place uh, from the International Coach Federation. So uh, that's a requirement that we do have, but it doesn't prevent you from coming and doing the accredited coach training. You'll sign a service agreement. There is an annual fee, which is currently set at $395. So you'll, you'll, you'll have an annual fee that you pay. Uh, and there's, what will happen is that every time you deliver the program, there'll be a program fee that you pay to us as part of that service agreement. That program fee is currently set at $1,400. So uh, you grab, grab a, a cohort of learners um, and for each of those learners, um, you'll pay a program fee. So for those of you that are in, interested in the income stream, you can talk to us a lot more about that. The recommended retail price of the level one program is $4,450. So you can do your sums around that as well. Um, a really, really great opportunity um, to, to build a business um, around your level one accredited training as well. So let me just pause for a moment, see if there's um, other questions um, here as well. We are really looking forward to bringing uh, people into the room. Uh, what will be happening is we're going to be unpacking exactly what you need and exactly how you go about delivering the level one program at the international level so that we are meeting the International Coach Federation standards. We're in line with the ICF core competencies um, and you are delivering a program that means your learners actually achieve level one accreditation. I think the other important thing here, Natalie, is around the support that you get you'll get from Open Door. So we will so from an um, organizational perspective, you'll you'll get your box, you'll be able to deliver. We will make that a super um, easy process. But what we're also going to do is create a community of level one coaches so that you've got other people to talk to and support. Um, you will have access to Natalie and myself um, whilst you're an accredited coach trainer and, and we can help you if you've got any questions or concerns. Uh, we'll also be making sure that, so you won't have to worry about if something needs to be updated, how do I update it? Because we'll automatically be doing that behind the scenes for you um, and looking at other ways to help build skill and, and development for level one coaches. So there's the, the 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 nuts and bolts of it is absolutely you'll you'll put in a request and your box will arrive and you can facilitate but then there's the added support that we'll do uh, around making sure you've got all your you know resources and and how do we build your skills and capacity as we're going along and make sure that you have people that you can talk to if you've got questions and or ideas and those sorts of things so it, it's there's there's the two parts of the support that we'll be providing. Yeah, I think that's really important that you point that out, Paula. Thank you. And I think what I'm most looking forward to is the continuous improvement as well. So as we work together as as a as a group of accredited coach trainers, Open Door every six months um, we are looking at what we need to update or improve, and um, that's built into our processes now. And we will be thinking about um, how we can tap into our wider network and alumni of, of amazing coaches that are doing the accredited coach training um, in order to create that continuous improvement. 
In the meantime, we provide you with the PowerPoint slides, we provide you with the agenda, we provide you with the trainer's notes, we provide you with all of the course materials that you need for your learners, uh, anything you need really in order to deliver the training um, at the International Coach Federation uh, level. As I said, you'll go out and find the clients and you'll uh, create your commercial arrangements around that with the venue hire, et cetera, et cetera. Um, but perhaps you're a coach now in your organisation and you're thinking about, well, well, how can I get more coaches? Uh, how can I get more level one accredited coaches in the organisation? Perhaps those people can be the coach mentors or the senior coaches within your organisation. Uh, perhaps they go on to roll out leader as coach or coaching 101 programs. So all of that's really possible in terms of how we build that powerful coalition within the organisations as well. So we are very happy to talk with you um, about the opportunity. You can talk to myself or you can talk to Paula. Uh, you can also go onto our website if you're interested in downloading the service agreement. Uh, you're more than welcome to see the, the ins and outs of that. We're being very open uh, in terms of the opportunity here. Of course, if you're interested in our Leader as Coach program, talk to us more about that. We still are delivering and a very powerful piece of our, the work that we do is our Certificate 4 in Workplace and Business Coach the full qualification. We do have upgrade paths if your learners want to achieve their level one accredited coach training and they want to upgrade to the full certificate for and workplace and business coaching qualification, they can do that as well. And they can also then uh, we can also, um, we're delivering the Diploma of Organisational Coaching, uh, formerly known as the Diploma of Workplace and Business Coaching as well. So a lot of great opportunities to really extend not only our own development as coaches and as coach trainers, but also extend out into our organisations and to the clients that we're working with. Very, very excited, very happy to talk to you about it. So again, just pausing to see if there's any uh, questions that you might have. Wonderful. Well, a bit of a shorter, sharper uh, coaching cafe today. As I mentioned, we will be back to our normal program and schedule uh, that we have uh, for our coaching cafe, sharing with you the coaching knowledge and coaching tools. You can pick up our past uh, coaching cafes on our website. Just hit up our blog area on our website. It is still performance conversation seasons for a lot of organisations. So we did record uh, a couple of weeks ago now, four or five coaching cafes specifically related to performance conversations in the workplace. So if that's you, you are coaching people or you're coaching managers to have better performance conversations, we are still in that season. You can pick up the coaching cafe recordings on our blog or via your favourite streaming service. So thank you everyone for being part of this really exciting initiative. We look forward to talking to you more about our level one accredited coach training uh, and we will say goodbye for now.